Okay, um, I have one more bonding event to do. What are those flowers for, Instructor Sarah? Uh, oh, these. Just a little errand of mine is all. I'm planning on heading down to the surface for a little bit. You can just reach me on my Arcus if you need me. I'll be sure to catch up with you guys right away. Uh, sure thing. Uh, what could we... What could she be doing with a bunch of flowers? Uh, the imagination runs wild. What if my hunch is right? Sorry if I'm getting the wrong idea, but... Are those flowers for your father? Alright, we did talk about that, didn't we? Uh, that battle was what set me into the path of becoming a bracer. Today's actually the anniversary of his death, right in the middle of all our operations. I see. Hey, Instructor Sarah, I don't mean to be a bother, but... Sarah's best girl. The Aragon Mine is just up ahead, huh? That's right. Noble families and heavy industry leaders have been fighting all uh, fighting over the mining rights here for years. They never get their own hands dirty, of course. They've got the Northern Jaegers and Needhog er, for that. Uh, I remember this uh, this grave. Unlike Sashin, the RF group has very little influence over Aragon. At least, that's the way it was eight years ago. A lot of people are interested in this place. The Imperial Army, the Provincial Army, the Noble and Reformist factions. Things really started heating up uh, when it looked like the fighting would reach the town itself. That's when my squad got ambushed by Needhog. -er. Uh, I always thought uh, we were the better fighters, but... There are. noble family that hired us isn't even around anymore, and the company that was paying Needhogger uh, was out of business too, or went out of business. So much can change in just a few years. Well, well, look who we got here. Needhogger. Your need hugger. What's going on here? And the Northern Jaegers. Y'all want revenge? Heard, I heard you were working together, but it's kind of hard to believe. Everyone's pals now that you're all Imperial dogs, is that it? Call it what you want, it's only temporary. But don't get the wrong idea. We're not here to fight, not today. Huh? Oh, I thought we were going to have to scrap. All of us hold Colonel Valestine in the highest regard. We won't ever forget what he did for us. We might fight for the Empire now, but we wanted to at least pay our respects. We lost good men and women on that day, too. Since we're supposed to be allies now, we figured we could put aside our differences and come here to remember those who've passed. I see. Looks like we misjudged you. I should have expected this from one of the most elite Jaeger Corps in existence. Makes sense you'd have some pride. Don't sweat it. Uh, we'll go make our offerings now. Don't worry, we didn't skimp. It's good stuff. What the? This presence. Reen, do you think? Yeah, they're coming. This is, uh, the Jaeger King? Oh. This is unexpected. What? Hostile spirits? Quick, get out of here, go! It hurts, curse you all. Why did we have to die out here so far from home? There... no way. Their spirits have... I've uh, been here the whole time. Uh, 
Oh no. Great Twilight again. This is the last thing we need. Why'd it have to happen today of all days? Reen, we'd better... You don't do Reen. You do Spirit Separation... Uh... Uh... Slash or something? Your powers as a sacrifice are attracting them. Reen, stop it. You can't just let them wipe everyone out. I'm fine, I promise. Just take the others and get out of here. Yeah! Reen! What the heck was that just now? Fall back, all of you. This isn't the kind of enemy you can deal with. But we can't just sit back and watch. Listen to me. You only get in the way. You might even get possessed again. I need to get my student back. I can't let anything interfere with that. Fine. But don't you dare die, Sarah. Uh, shoop. Retreat. Good luck, Purple Lightning. I don't know what shoop means. I know this isn't the time or place, but I can't help feeling kind of pumped. Daddy, lend me your strength. Are we gonna scrap? I can do this. I'm the Purple Lightning, A rank Bracer, Imperial Guild member, instructor of Old Class 7. I'm Sarah Valestine, here I go. Deep top flow. Oh boy. Bring it on! Yeah! No! Yeah, there it is. Supreme yeah. Crimson Slash. Uh, that was a very mean thing you did. I'm actually terrified right now. Let's go. Of what's huh? what's gonna happen here. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'm just sitting here dying. Yeah. Can I seal you? Pretty much no. But like an attack here would be a huge mistake. that. Thank you. Um... Alright, very last thing I need to do is battle scope. Yeah. A hero known as the Ashen Chevalier and the sacrifice of the Great Twilight gone berserk, he turns on Sarah. Yeah! 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 Should have done this first, I guess. Lightning, charge me up! It's fine. I got this! Die! There it is! I needed that. Yeah! It's my turn! Okay. Well, we lost. Yeah, I messed up. I always knew you had potential. You've really grown these last three years, Reen. Sorry, Daddy. Please forgive me. It's okay, Reen. I'm here. I'll accept you no matter what. 
I'm, I'm guessing there is a possibility that you can win that, but that's a lot of damage. So come on. You have so many people in your life to come back to. He said, shut the heck up. Green. Get back. Grunting noises. Why? Stop it. Don't you know what'll happen if you keep pushing yourself like that? I could say the same to you, huh? You're going to stop me? I have people that need me? What gives you any right to say that to me when you're planning to throw your life, your own life, Throw away your own life. Something. You're not your father, Sarah. You don't have to do what he did. He wouldn't want that. No one does. You know that, right? But... And besides, you're just as important to me as the others. I don't want to do this if you're not here with me. There you go. Green, that's so like him. I'm sorry. That was pretty stupid of me, I'll admit. Please, Reen. Don't cry. I'm not crying. I'm just glad you're all right. I'm so sorry. Boy, you sure are a problem, child. I can't take my eyes off you for a second, can I? We ain't getting bonus uh, AP from this, if there's such a thing as bonus AP from this. Exhausted from their battle, Reen and Sarah collapse next to each other. After resting a while, they return to the ship together, faring, sharing very few words along the way. Uh, some way to pay my respects. Look at these poor things. I'll have to think of something else. Instructor, I'm sorry, I shouldn't have... No, it's okay. I appreciate you coming, Reen. It meant a lot to me. Huh? What I'm saying is, I'd love... Uh, I'd love for you to try... I'd love for you to come with me again next time I try. If it's not too much trouble, I mean. Of course, I'd be happy to. Hey, got the little heart. All right, that's all the bonding points that I have. We're going to save. And it's time to go places. So that's presumably for Ash. That's presumably for Usus. That's presumably for Fee. This one would be for Reen. Reen, Elliot, Machias, Sarah. Elliot Machias Actually, going all the way to the sides like this, pretty good strategy. Here we go, reverse triangle formation. Um, we'll just, you know, give you something. I thought I picked something up that prevents mute, but uh, 
either somebody else has it equipped or I'm just a liar. Let's give you that. Machius. Give you something. Um, Got to be somebody who wants this uh, this headband. Can't remove her weapon. From, can't remove her weapon either. Interesting. Oh, you got it. Alright, there we go. I mean, we don't need that one anymore. So, where's the one that prevents death? Alrighty. Let's go do this trial chest and die. <clears throat> A horrible, flaming, fiery death. Uh, saving just in case, this is actually going to be too difficult for me. I'm sure it will be. Gary, watch out! <clears throat> Let's go! Alright, we're off to a wonderful start. Uh, yeah! It's my turn! Warm up! Warm up. Iron wheel formation! Let's go! Ha! Go get him, Ring. None of my watch! Let's go. Uh, yeah. They're going to do. Please hear my song. Thanks. I appreciate it. Thanks. Well, Ready. Ellie, it's pretty good. Oh, you have an instant cast analyze too. I am so confused. All right, so higher elements are the way to go for you. You can be put to sleep, nightmare, and stat down. Yeah. Yeah. Lightning, charge me up. <sighs> Let's go. Casting is not allowed. Roar! Uh, helix strike! It's down! Take this! You're... <laughs> that to the wrong person. It's my turn! Yeah, yes you are. Barrier of time! Break! Yeah! Now! Higher Earth is activate! Yeah. Oh boy. Fear! Uh, I don't have anybody that can stop that, so we're gonna be taking. Ooh, the nightmare! Now! I can't believe it. I should uh, back off a little bit. Yeah. Here. <laughs> Gonna be an annoying fight. <laughs> Are you okay? I appreciate it. <laughs> right, 
Oh, the back ring. Are you okay? I appreciate it. It's my turn. Guessing this is too far. Please, nope. hear my song. Thanks. I appreciate it. Thanks. I got this. Form up. Iron will formation. It's my turn. Ha! Here's our chance. An opening. <sighs> How to be obnoxious. Let's go. 101. Heal yourself and get a turn immediately afterwards. Let's go! Tough. Now! This one's mine! My turn! It's my turn! Yeah. Let's go! Shit! Yeah! Let's go. actually did a lot of damage. Leave it to me. Uh, now. Arcus, activate. I'm up. Roar. Uh, helix strike. It's down. This one's mine. Got broken? Huh. That's unexpected. This'll help! <laughs> Thank you. I wasn't even paying attention to that. Leave it to me. Initiate Omega Operation! Leave it to me. There! Here! Keep it up! Yeah! Now! Might be able to do some Sarah shenanigans at the end of this. Yeah. Huh? It's my turn. Take this! They're down! Keep it up! My turn! Uh. Now! Take this! Yeah. It's That's... my turn! You're just one shy. Okay, we'll we'll S craft them. It's time to get a suppression oh. complete. Good work, everyone. I almost did Elliot's there. Woohoo! True thundering roar. <laughs> Yay! I did it. My song area LL plus restores more HP. Iron Will EX to Black Tortoise. All right, so I think I'm correct with my, my whatchamacallit. So I think it went up in turns. I think it went from six to eight. It's at, or maybe, maybe the damage reduction is all that went up. It was at 40%, now it's at 60% which puts it in line with someone else's. Uh, but not quite as good as Talus. All right, I believe that's the only trial chest that I care about right now. That one's 133. Not gonna be doing that one for a very long time. Yeah. Okay, so let's go back to the Merkaba and swap out party members. Uh, I guess it would be a little bit easier here.
kind of want to bring Crow along, but whatever. Whoops. I hit random. Where would you like to go? Where are our tasks at? Um, Raquel, Distillery, West Lemaire Highway. So let's go ahead and do this right now. There it is, all the I got way this. in the back. Let's ride! Yeah! Yeah, 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 yeah. As, a, as they say. Uh, speed this up a little bit. Oh, hello, friend. You look scary. Be careful. This one's strong. Be careful. Uh. I'm up. Okay. Got a bunch of little homies. My turn. Roar. <sighs> Helix strike. It's down. Let's, Let's go, go, everyone. Sure. Leave it to me. Yeah, understood. understood. Throw out all yeah. <laughs> I got this. I'm trying to do that one. You're mine! It's down! It's mine! We got a horse? Yeah, we got a horse! My turn! So proud. Oh, strike! Ah! An opening! It's Congratulations down. on your 13,000 damage. It's mine! Not today. My turn. Uh, I believe Reen killed one of those little guys, so I didn't have to. Search mode them. activated. Hoping that's the case. Scan complete. Let's go. Roar! Helix <gasps> uh, strike! It's down. I'll assist. Weak. Now. Be weak against Earth. Charging. What a coincidence. That's exactly what I, I got this on first. Go ahead and uh, throw out one of these. Now. Eat this. Here's dessert. That's what you get for being careless. Very well. Um, I did one of these, and it did so much break damage. I was shocked. Yourself. Ha! Shatter. Look how much break damage it does. There. Absolutely it's insane mine. in the membrane. Ha. Let's go. Let's see. Let's see here. It's gonna be kind of a waste. Uh, 
Let's go! Raging fire formation! I'm up! Roar! Uh, Helix strike! Now! Let's go, Altina! I shall go! Charging! Yeah. Look at you, uh, Charging. doing a little bit of machine gunning. Sure. Oh, you Let's didn't go. die to that. Huh. But you died to that. That wasn't too bad. I hope I got the Behold, double scouter. The Vander style. I only got one. Life is hard. All right, got it. <laughs> nice. I must train even more. I think that Severine Stats was okay. level 100. Woohoo! Yep. Why don't we drop some more frames? Yeah, got an extra bonding point. Alright, let's go to Rackle. I want to go over there. What is here that... doing here? Leonora and Herman, I think. Her old comrade from the Silver Whale Navy convoy. Seems like he's uh, mellowed out quite a bit. I remember that side quest. Side quest kicked my butt as far as I was like, I'm just going to skip this and I had no idea how to progress it. Structorine, fancy seeing you here. I take it you're all back on the move. Sure went out of your way to come out here, huh? Honestly, this is just a happy coincidence. I take it you two uh, got here on that bike. Look familiar? It's yours. We grabbed it and two others uh, to make our getaway uh, when you were fighting in front of the Grawl. But they all ended up having their own share of problems and in the end, uh, we just kind of let, let them sit. That's when they came, and that's when it came to me. Or they came, I don't know, gotta admit. I wasn't thrilled when Leonora asked me to fix them all up for free, but after all the trouble I've caused this gal, I wasn't about to tell her no. So I ended up asking a workshop tied with Kleiston Co. to handle the repairs. They just finished them this morning. I wanted to make sure they weren't any more, uh, there weren't any more kinks to work out, so we took it out for a little test drive, and now here we are. Quite the story, and yet an escape on a fleet of stolen motorcycles followed by... A free tune-up sounds like a very Leonora adventure. Yeah, yeah, I'm just glad I've done right by her now. I'll ship the other two bikes to you once I get back to the shop. Now they're all yours, Instructorine, enjoy. I'd be happy to, but don't you think you'd get more use out of them, Leonora? Not really, to be honest. Besides, if I ever need a bike, I can just make Herman lend me one. Hey, says who? Hey. And off with the orbital bikes. Hey, got ourselves a bike. Hey, 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 hey. I like the bikes more than the horses. Alright, the old La Mer Road. There's actually somewhere else My that turn. I want to go. Can't ride a bike here, though. Um. Let's get going. I want to go to the West Languedoc. Am I going the right way? Yes. Let's uh, speed this process up.
Jaegers could be a problem. Well, I, I don't mind. I'm, I'm ready for a fight. Let's do it. Fine. The rest lodge, all that is new. The rackle, all that is new. So many new things to go to. All right, to the entrance. Side quest? Well, we'll just say side quest. This is who I think it is. What are you doing here? Well, hey, it's you guys. You're that dancer, Sully, right? Well, this is a surprise. We haven't seen you since Crossbell. Thank you for helping my students out back then. And if I'm not mistaken, you're the mysterious songstress, aren't you? I see my repu reputation precedes me. Yeah, we get it. You're famous. What are you doing in Raquel? Come to check out the uh, Tarandot or something? We're on tour. We just stepped out for a minute to get some fresh air and talk about our routine. All the, uh, all the Empire is a stage. We've got to give, uh, give other cities a taste of what we can do uh, now and then. I doubt we could put food on the table if we just stayed in Crossbell all year round. Sounds like a lot of work. Anyway, sorry, we didn't mean to interrupt. Hope your tour goes well, break a leg. We'll see. Always nice to hear from our fans. Sully. Sucker. What are you doing here? You spying on me? What are you doing here? Everybody and their mamas is just taking trips all over the place, man. Okay. <sighs> Give us the lowdown. Excuse me, you're Kayla, right? I believe you made a request to find your friend. Yes, that's right. Am I right in thinking that uh, you are all the group taking my request in place of the guild, then? Essentially, yes. Well, some of us are bracers. Somehow, I feel like we've already met each other recently. Huh? Uh, when we were at the rest lodge, you and the other chick claimed to be from Remiferia. I take it you're sticking to that backstory this time, too. It, uh, would it inconvenience you to be less blunt? Rather rude of you to call it a backstory, but that aside, as I'm requesting assistance, I'll be showing you at least a certain degree of sincerity. It may not seem so, but I'm quite impressed with the Ashen Chevalier, Mr. Schwarzer, and his schoolmates. Even if the same can't be said of about you halfwits. You're in no position to call us rude, are you now? Maybe don't try to antagonize my students too much, all right? Anyway, you seem to know a lot about me already. In any case, we all have a lot going on, but there is something I want to say. Regarding this request, I have no ill will toward the Empire or yourselves, so I would be delighted to receive your help. I don't even know what it's about, but whatever. Circumstance has brought us together, so of course we'd be happy to help. Thank you. Oh, something about looking for your friend who got to Erebonia ahead of you. Yes, his name is Cody. He's 18 years old. He's a blonde-haired young man who has a principality of uh, Remiferia passport like myself. By the way, I did put a missing persons ad in the Imperial Chronicle. That's how I received some reports that he was in Raquel. I see, that's good thinking. Uh, but this is as much as I can do. The reason being that my goal for chasing him down isn't to just find him, but rather to apprehend him. If I go around asking for information on his whereabouts, it's very likely that he'll find out. That's why I wanted to be more subtle and have someone he doesn't know track him down. Makes sense to me. So much for this being a missing person request. I'm fully aware that this is a very unreasonable request. As such, I won't force you to take it, but... It's fine, we've accepted the request, so we're going to see it through. Anyway, do you know what clothes Cody is wearing? I do. According to the latest information, I believe he's wearing a blue top and dark beige pants. 
a blonde foreigner, and we know what he's wearing. This might be easier than I thought. Well, our target will probably be on high alert. If we want to find where he's hiding, we're going to have to tread carefully. Indeed, for the time being, if you catch sight of the target, please contact me before doing anything else. Then we can discuss what steps to take next. Understood. Alright, let's get to it. If we charge in headfirst without any info, we'll just stand out. Let's start by asking the people around the station square. Odie Red. I, uh, I don't know if we should have accepted this. You know, we basically just agreed to attack somebody or kidnap somebody uh, all because some person we don't know is requesting it. Uh, and we don't even know if she's like police or anything. Hey boys, uh, why don't you come and hang out with... Well now, seems you're looking for something else at the moment, aren't you? Yeah, sorry. There was something we wanted to ask you real quick. Person. Young blonde guy, huh? Yeah, I definitely remember seeing a guy like that around here recently. Tried talking him into coming into the club a couple of times, but he just brushed it off. I think he went to Icaros Mart this morning. You got a sharp eye, huh? Even for a guy in your line of work. Well, well yeah. I gotta look out for that kind of stuff. Don't want to waste my time talking up someone I know ain't interested, yeah? Anyway, I don't have time to chit chat. Of course, thanks for the help. Alright, sounds like we should pay a visit to Icaros Mart then. Yeah, not like we've got anything else to go on. Icaros. What's up, Yang? Excuse me, I was wondering if you could help us with something. Sounds like the gentleman that stopped by this morning. We've had to put restrictions on how much a customer can buy during a single visit because of the current climate. I remember him because he buys food every day. When you add up everything, he really buys a lot. Maybe he's giving it out to his friends. I see. What did you two talk about? This morning he asked if we had a special type of rifle ammo. He said we don't stock them and uh, recommended the pawn shop. Uh, Mick on Rose, huh? They definitely got all sorts of stuff there. Thanks for telling us. Guess our next stop is the pawn shop. Bars. Yeah, we have to stop by after hearing that. Next stop is the pawn shop. Oh, almost went to the pub. Bub dog. Alright, we've got something we want to ask you, old man. Oh yes, I remember that young fella. Uh, he was after a size of rifle ammunition you don't typically see here in the Empire. Then bought ones that are almost only used in Vern Company made rifles. The Vern Company is Calvardian. Right on the money. Some blonde 18 year old. It'd be funny if this turns out to be that guy we saw before, huh? It would be kind of funny. It would. Yep, that guy. That's exactly who I was thinking. I'm pretty sure he was supposed to be deported back to Calvard though, right? Well, either way, we should ask Kayla again if she has some more information. You know where he went after that, on Road? I'm afraid I don't. Uh, you gave us enough to get started. We should uh, head out and get to asking around. Sounds like a plan. Guess we owe you one, old man. Uh, don't you even worry about it. What's going on, Sydney and Maya? I ain't gonna talk to you. Guess we should start asking around, uh, round out on the main street. Wait, you feel that too? Yeah, there's somebody nearby keeping an eye on us. Darn it, he's noticed us. He's gonna make a break for it. Let's pin this bastard down. He's got that Calvardian battle orbment, Ramda, right? Gave him a real easy time slipping right by us. True, but I think we should be able to catch up. We need to hurry, 
uh, so we don't lose track of them. If you don't head in the exact direction of your fleeing target, you won't gain AP. There he is, we got him. Hooray! He's gone on to North Languedoc Canyon Road. Right, let's catch up to him. Hooray! They sprung that out on me like, oh man, you best pay attention. The heck? Darn, he's quick. That Cody's a Calvardian agent, all right. The Hercules Special Forces, huh? I would have figured he'd been sent back to the Republic by now. Regardless, we should follow him north and keep Kayla apprised of the situation. Where am I going? All right, okay. let's go. We weren't able to go there before. Let's get going. Room, room. Ooh, a tough one. Yeah, we're gonna skip that tough one. Looks like a toughie. Stay on your toes. This world's been sealed off by the government forces, so it's pretty much an ideal hiding place then. You can definitely sense people ahead, so this has got to be it. Yeah, and luckily for us, it seems our target thinks he managed to lose us along the way. Let's see if we can get... if we, uh... Let's see if we can get any closer while we wait for Kayla. Squad zero or squad five, come in. This is Warrant Officer Cody. No hostile sighted. Over. Please respond. Seeing you loud and clear, Warrant Officer. Good work. Thanks to your efforts, the operation is proceeding as planned. Most would balk at accepting a solo mission in enemy territory, but you've clearly got the chops to handle the pressure. Captain Reagan. I'm not worthy of any praise, sir. Not after the way I cracked. I ran out on uh, you all when you needed me. I'm nothing but a coward. Uh, that you'd still call me your comrade is more honor than I deserve. But what is it? About the operation, sir. I can't get behind the idea of harming civilians, even if they are from the Empire. Cody, don't tell me you're going soft on us now. Where's your pride, soldier? Think of everything the Empire has done to Calvard and its citizens. I'm not denying that, it's just... Does, so uh, does something seem a little off about him to you guys? Still find it hard to believe a Hercules squad could infiltrate Erebonia so easily. Yes, exactly. Ah, Kayla. I still can't tell you everything, but you seem to have a solid enough grasp of the situation. They are the Hercules 5th Squad, which has been operating inside the Empire since the Summer Festival. They were captured and were uh, on track to be repatriated not long after. But when the Emperor was shot, the authorities suddenly had more pressing concerns at hand. It would have been easy enough for the Hercules squad to break out and slip away in all the confusion. Why can't things ever be simple? At present, they seem to be planning to create some kind of disturbance within the Empire. Since they're acting without any sort of official sanction, the Calvardian government wants them stopped at all costs. Sounds like the Republic has plenty of its own problems to deal with. Even so, this is as far as we can go today. You've given us a considerable leg up by uncovering their hideout. We'll start devising a countermeasure and... Yo, know, the heck's he doing? He's attacking his own ally. Wait, her name was... Second Lieutenant. Maybe I didn't make myself clear. How about I let my blade remind you of the punishment of insubordination. Captain Reagan, no, why are you doing this? Stop. 10 hours and still going strong. You betcha. This marathon is not going to stop until I beat this game. Uh-huh, sis, 
What? Sis? What is this? Kayla, I should have known. And you brought the cavalry, too. Cody, you idiot. You let yourself get tailed. Everyone, we're making an emergency retreat. Move out. Wait. What? Why is that guy running with him? Cody, wait. Well, she's a Calvard agent, too. Cody. Kayla. The jig's up. Sorry you had to see me like this. We finally got some good intel, and I let my personal feelings get the better of me. Uh, don't beat yourself up. It was only natural you'd want to save Cody. I'm a little surprised, though. I didn't realize he was your brother. Anyway, I got a bad feeling about that guy calling the shots back there. You think maybe he's still messed up from that time he was night-touched by the Dark Dragon? After what we just saw, I'd say it's a definite possibility. If you're right, then I can't afford to waste any time. I wish I could do something uh, to thank you all, but I promise I'll find out uh, where they're planning to strike next and stop them. We appreciate it, and if you need any help, we'd be happy to pitch in. Yeah, I've, I figure you're still getting used to how things work here in the Empire. Hit us up if you've got a lead. And here's an idea. Maybe don't keep us in the dark next time. You're all too generous for your own good. If you'll excuse me, I need to get in touch with my other operatives. Thank you so much for everything. Hmm. Just like I figured, not even Schwarzer can sense us from this distance. That woman, Kayla, was it? She sure has made a mess of things for us. Major Lecter. Are you sure it's alright to let Class 7 go free on top of the Hercules squad getting away? Yeah, the way things are now, it's better not to get involved. My to-do list is lengthy enough as it is. Maybe we can just pretend we didn't see any of this go down. Perhaps you're right, we're plenty busy already. If that's your call, I won't go against it. You are the son of my old commanding officer after all. We'll just think of it as them getting lucky this time around. Schwarzer, Carbide, this one's on me. Don't say I never did anything for you. Schwarzer can totally sense him from that distance. Hey, Reen. Got a moment? What's up, Tower? Hey, Tower. Sure, what's up? Any new leads? Yes, in fact. Been informed some suspicious activities taking place in Sutherland. Sutherland, huh? That would coincide with Marquis Higharm's absence. It's more than just a coincidence. I was dumbstruck when I heard that. Go on. Uh, never mind. Can you drop by sometime soon? I have new info about the Thor's network, too. I think it'd be better for us to discuss it in person. Of course. See you soon. Guess Herschel's got something for us, huh? Wonder why she was so coy about it, though. Yeah, me too. Let's go back to the Merkaba once we're done here. She was coy about it because that's... That's... Let's get going. Be coy. Be humble. Sit down. Okay, 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 okay. I just did the quest in Rackle, aka Raquel. So now we need to go to the distillery. I don't remember where the distillery is. Uh, but I believe it's in this general direction. I'm guessing they're not going to let me go up to Jirai. I don't think we'll ever get to go to Jirai. I guess I could have fast traveled, huh? But 
Where's the fun in that? I mean, I could just accidentally run into an enemy, you know? Maybe drink some of this water. Been talking all day. Come all the way over here for nothing. Artem, Bella, Roscoe. Wait, 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 wait. Wasn't Artem the kid that ran away and took all the tram side quest? I'm bored. I want to do something already. Why can't I go out and play? I'm pretty sure. I, I, I'm I pretty sure because I remember Roscoe. I was like, Roscoe, you know, go make some waffles. Finally made it this far, and yet, if I don't make a decision soon, we're going to end up flat broke. What am I going to do? Finally managed to contact one of my friends back home. They said it'd be better for us to stay away for now. The army's out drafting anyone they can get their hands on. But we managed to make it so close to North Ambria. What to do? What a horrible reason to be kept away from your home. Not like we can do anything about it, though. I'm pretty sure that's, uh... Those are the people I'm thinking of. Hello, Edel, Edel, and Sandy. You're here with her. Dr. Reen, it's so great to see you again. Well, it isn't Reen and his friends. You're all looking well. Though I suppose uh, you were when I saw you in Ordis, too. So that's not surprising. We were just talking about you. Oh, really? Well, you really have a knack for showing up just when we need you, Edel. It seems like you always know exactly what we're up to. Oh, I merely connected the dots. I already knew uh, that there were Thor's associates in Ordis at the time. Uh, so all I needed to do was reach out to the branch campus students while you were busy infiltrating the city. Nothing special, really. Nothing special, she says. Uh, I'd heard you were working together with Vincent and some of the other alumni, but I had no idea the scope uh, of the scope of your operation. Well, Edel's family is kind of a big deal around here. They're popular with the other nobles and beloved and trusted by the commoners. Regardless, it seems like things are really beginning to escalate. I'll be staying here with Sandy and the other members of Thor's to gather information. We're behind you all the way, but don't give up. Thanks. We're glad to have your help. Welcome. Okay. Um, oh, Alster. That's probably the, the, the place. going on sheep going on rooster going on chicken Teary and Anton didn't we just get like a very suspicious conversation with them hey buddy get over here a sec will ya wait was Anton the guy that was looking for the girl? I must have missed a, uh, a discussion with them. Uh, you mean me? Girl looks like trouble. What do I do? Is she gonna turn violent? I need this mirror, uh, mirror to accomplish something important. Take me down all you want, but I'll never hand it over. Huh? What an, uh, what an adios, uh, are you talking about? Well, whatever. You, uh, you see a kid named Cargo anywhere around here? We got separated back in Heimdallar. But he's my responsibility and I gotta find him. Oh, is that all? Sorry, I thought you were trying to mug me. I actually just arrived in, in this town in search of someone myself. 
So I'm afraid I haven't heard anything about your cargo. That's too bad. But I get it. You got your own problems. Who's it you're looking for? I'll keep an eye out. We're in the same boat, so we may, be, may, may as well help each other out, right? So kind, thank you. You're a lot nicer than you look. Well now, how to describe her. Teary. Hey, you're Machias' dweeby friends. Uh, where the heck have you guys been? Everyone said you disappeared, but you don't look disappeared to me. <laughs> Sorry, we've had a lot to deal with. I promise you, though, Machias is okay. What about you? Did I hear you say something about Cargo? I've been searching for him for a month now. Uh, when those darn monsters swarmed the capital, me and Cargo tried to get people out. But we split up, and I haven't seen him since. Uh, but there's no way he can be dead. No way. Uh, I know he's out there somewhere. Well, that's what happened. Did I accidentally skip a dialogue, or did something just weird happen? I don't know. Cargo's not uh, the only one missing, either. Cargo is my responsibility. I'll find him no matter what it takes. So if you nerds hear anything about him, you best tell me, got it? Yikes. Felt like she was gonna mug me too. Calling me, uh, dweebs and nerds. So go, I laid a smack down. I'm the Ashen Chevalier. You want to play a card battle? I'll body you. I'm uh, I'm like 10 and 2. That's enough to go to the Magic World series, right? Alright, I'm just going to walk in all these buildings so that they're no longer new. I have no interest in talking to anybody. Unless they have something I want. Like some cards. Maybe a book. Oh, I thought that old guy right there was Marquis Ballad. I was like, uh, what are you doing here? A lot of people up in here. Welcome. Oh, if my eyes aren't mistaken. Good to see you all. Looks like you came after seeing our request, right? Wow, I heard the stories, but that hair, those clothes. Uh, if that isn't the most rock look I've ever seen. I'm glad to see you look well. I could say the same to all of you. What the heck are you guys doing back here? Yeah, the Modern Music Club met, uh, met up in Raquel to share information. And right about then, we got a ring from Sandy. Figured we may as well come over seeing as uh, we were in walking distance. I was hoping we'd be able to do this on our own, but I'm sure you're aware of how that goes. The only thing, though, is that a few key components are completely busted. Right. Uh, we first had Kai and Gasco, the town's best engineers, take a look at it. Sound, uh, it sounds like repair just isn't an option. These parts need to be replaced entirely. You said in your request that it just needed to be repaired. You want us to be your gophers and run around finding all the parts, is that it? Well, I would have worded it a bit different, but yeah, pretty much. Uh, if you have the time, would you mind stepping in to help us a hand? Definitely. We'll help out however we can. Thank you, we really appreciate it. Can't begin to tell you how much this means to us. I'm kind of surprised to see you use an old hunk of metal like that for anything, honestly. Checking things real quick. Okay. Uh, trouble's brewing, huh? Yeah, times are tough. The military is requiring liquor for the troops so they can relax. We need to produce a large amount for that. But on the other hand, the general population's looking at a sudden shortage. Even in darker times, Steinrose has some very loyal customers out there. The demand is great. I'd, uh, I'd do anything to figure out how to mass produce it. Dad's conscription threw us for a loop. 
He's usually the one in charge, but now he's running the brewery, brewery for the military. We have to keep our quality high, but thorough checks often result in production speed dropping. That does sound difficult. That's why we brought out the old distiller. It might not be cutting edge, but if it helps supplement production, then why not? As you heard, some of the key components are beyond repair. It's not producing a single drop in its current state. Now, there are three parts in particular we're having trouble getting. The first is a pressure valve. It's used to lower the pressure in the dis distillation still. Next, we have the cooling coil. It's a tube that efficiently cools vaporized alcohol to turn, in, turn it into liquid. And last but not least, a large pump gear. It's one of the parts that transfers the refined alcohol back to the storage tank. Thanks, I think we've got a good idea what you need. Good idea? Man, do we even know where we can find these things? I sure as heck don't. Ash may be impolite, but he's not incorrect. I don't think we'll be able to procure these items easily. Just so you know, we already went to both the workshop and exchange shop in Raquel looking after these parts. No luck at either, I'm afraid. Uh, but if you check in with Mr. Dwight from Parm, he might just be able to help you with the pump. Can't say for sure, though. Nothing really comes to mind for pressure valves, I'm afraid. Doesn't seem like the kind of part a traditional workshop would carry. Uh, it'd have to be a workshop with state-of-the-art equipment, and it can't be on the Imperial Defense Force's radar, either. It seems that cooling coils are also used to refine perfumes and pharmaceuticals. That's all the information I have for you. Uh, I have no idea where you could find one. Well, if we put our heads together, we might be able to come up with a few lo potential locations. Uh, that's good enough start, thanks a lot. We can make it happen. Let's get it done already. I don't think that this mission will end up being too difficult, to be honest. Let's get started. Fantastic, thanks again. Good luck, you guys. <sighs> that was a lot. I feel the voice, uh, you know, starting to break down. Oh, did I mark for hour 10? I have no idea. I'll figure it out. Let's go to the Osgiloth Basin. Osgil Osgiliath. extra area over there. Oh, hello, friend. Now. Yeah, I remember that guy from Cold Steel 2. That guy is no friend of ours. Uh, I would love turn. to attack these guys on the way back, but I'll probably just fast travel. We have the advantage. It's down. I'll assist. I got this. Yeah. Yeah. It's mine. Burning mammoth covered in rose petals. Let's go. Uh, burning mammoth in a field of evil flowers now search mode activate detailed information obtained i shall go oh you got lucky on that one eh. all right now. i think we can auto this an opening now i'll assist hm. it's down it's mine I'd say this calls for a drink. How about it, pretty boy? Maybe once we're old enough. Ha! <coughs> <coughs> huh. huh. Shit! We strike! Yep, these are all new enemies. I was gonna gale right there, but he's not at 200 CP, so. My turn. We'll let it slide for now. Huh. 
Strike! I got this. Oh, I shall go. Speed. Oh. Search mode activate. Can out of battle the rest of this now. It's down! I'll assist! There! It's mine! Yeah! Got no time to waste. These guys give no experience. What level are these guys? Shit! Shit! Ready! Ready. Whew, felt pretty good. Looks like a toughie. Stay on your toes. It's gonna be a... There! This one's strong! Be careful! There we go. Sure to treat this seriously. It's my turn. Let's, Let's go. go. Raging, Raging fire, fire formation. formation. It's my turn. Green wants you to know that it's his turn. Roar! <sighs> Helix strike! It's down! I'll assist. I got this. Keep it like that. You're mine! And swap it. It's on down! Kurt's turn. It's go time, Kurt! My turn. Ha ha ha! Strike! It's I know down. you guys didn't have any faith in that. An opening! Now. Um, well, we'll there. keep our stuff here. There! It's mine! Let's go! Roar! <gasps> Helix strike! Come at me! Let's Green. go! Why do you do so much damage? Get back! <sighs> we just okay? one shot all these guys. Don't worry about it. Shit! There! Can I see the mammoth from here? There! Ha! There! Ready! Ha! Got some fish bait. Ha! Laura and Emma. There! Now's our chance! And that travels so far. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. I'll assist. Let's go. Huh. My turn. Search. <laughs> Not today. You know how to battle the rest hey. of this. There. It's mine. Take this now. This guy it's doesn't mine. stand much of a hey. chance here. Chuck. It's down! An opening! Shit! Now! It's mine! Good! Good work, everybody. Sure. Alrighty. So there's some other stuff going on over here. That looks like Daryl. We're gonna we're gonna save before we talk to her. You never know, she could be like, you know, you guys have grown up quite a bit. I think it's time for me to turn into a three-headed dragon and uh, and eat you guys.
Ah, so fate has seen fit to reunite us at last. We last saw her in the Castle of Mirrors in Michelin. What's the freaky occult girl gonna tell us this time? She was a schoolmate of yours, right, instructor? I'd heard my students might have run into you, but honestly, this is the last place I ever expected to see you, Beryl. Can't say it's not a pleasant surprise in a way. Likewise, you did well to return to your friends. But that would mean that this face fateful thread has yet to be cut, would it not? Would it? I have no idea. Wait, back during the Civil War, you were investigating places of heightened spiritual activity. Is this one of them? Indeed, I sensed a curious energy. I followed it and ended up here. A colossal presence lingers in this land. You all sense it too, do you not? I don't sense a thing. Could this colossal presence be what I think it is? But how would she? Putting the creation of this great hollow aside for a moment, it seems a higher dimensional being has revealed itself. I believe that if you defeat it, you will obtain something extraordinary. Did you just give us useful information? Thanks. I wonder what happens if I beat it and then go talk to her. Uh, you can see right to the bottom of the basin from here. It's like a crater has been gouged right out of the earth. What could have caused this? That might be a good photo. Looking good. Alright, Barrel. Stay creepy. Where does this go? It's powerful. Ooh. We must take care. Almost Treasure located. Into that enemy. Bottom buckle. There's an enemy up there that looked very different from all the other enemies I've seen. I don't know if I fought one of these. Now's our chance. I have not. Crimson Slash! I got this. You're mine! It's down! Uh, we're not gonna My do turn. that because I. Okay, I was like, I think you just killed. All of them. Yeah. Now. But Search you did, and I'm so proud of you. Detailed information obtained. Right. I'll save you. <laughs> Thanks. You can autobot all the rest of this. Yeah. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> Done already. actually should have went to the end there because maybe there was like a ladder or something that I could have knocked down <sighs> but we'll see what barrel has to say after I die to this guy but maybe if I'm lucky kill this guy <laughs> 